for 2030. Over the coming decade, we'll focus on four strategic priorities. To be a center for extraordinary teaching and research. To be a pioneer of access, sustainability, and opportunity. To be an academy that prepares young people for the challenges of the 21st century. All underpinned by world-class facilities and a commitment to excellence in all we do. Together, I believe we'll get fast the net zero carbon. We'll eliminate finance as a barrier to studying at Hartford. We'll make the next leap forward in finding the highest potential talent. I believe we'll be a good neighbour. We'll develop not just knowledge, but skills and character, head, hand and heart. We'll anticipate the way that technology will change, how, what and why we learn, and we'll make our expertise more accessible. These aspirations have been driven by all four common rooms, and we're excited to share them with you now. Hartford 2030 is about pioneering access, student support and opportunity. Though we are not the wealthiest of colleges, Hartford still sits at the top of the leaderboards in terms of affordable living and state school admissions. I think this speaks volumes about the college's generosity and its commitment to widening access for all students. Hartford NCR is a growing international community with a wide range of backgrounds and seeing student support and graduate outreach at such a prominent place in Hartford 2030 is really promising for the work that we do. Hartford has long been a pioneer for access. In the next 10 years we will continue to look for innovative ways to attract and admit to the most talented students from underrepresented backgrounds at all levels of study. We want all students to thrive at Hartford and we'll provide them with the support they need to succeed in their studies and prepare for life, employment and contributing to the wider world. I'm excited to see sustainability principles being applied at all levels of college life not only in our day-to-day -day operations, but also the teaching model, our investment policy, and helping Hartfordians be at the heart of tackling the climate crisis through teaching, research, and practical action. Sustainability is about economic and social angles. So access to higher education, elimination of social inequalities, and student well-being is all part of it. It's all interconnected. For Hartford 2030, we've got some really ambitious plans for this site. I'm standing in uh, OB Quad and feeling so affectionate towards these buildings, particularly because I've hardly been here for the last year for the pandemic. So our plan is to make uh, our facilities really fit for the 21st century, not only for teaching and research, but for the social side of college, uh, which is so important for where people are going to meet friends for life. At Oxford, teaching by active researchers is at the core of what we do. And one of the aspects of Hartford 2030 that we want to develop is to ensure that we get the right balance between the teaching and administrative burdens by our fellows and lecturers and their ability to conduct world-leading research. With all books being so expensive, it can raise the cost of studying here by quite a lot. But with the expansion of the college library, future law students will have essential books available to them for free, right on their doorstep. For me, there's an attitude about Hartford, an energy that's a wee bit cheeky, a bit irreverent, ambitious, brave even. Obviously, we're proud of being one of the first colleges to go co-ed, and of course the brilliant Tanner scheme that certainly changed my life. I'm ridiculously proud of that, as it blew the doors wide open to a really diverse range of students who've all continued to add more energy to the place. Clubs like the Boat Club are great for building a community spirit at Hartford. They give you the opportunity to meet new people. They also give a great outlet from the stress of work. And it's a fantastic way to connect with alumni who've walked in your shoes. Our history as a pioneer of liberty and tolerance. Our future of creativity and innovation on these great challenges of access, equality, sustainability and opportunity. A front line for a better society and a stunning location at the heart of Oxford. And of course, our bridge and our cat. 
I hope that you're as excited as I am about delivering these aspirations. Please join this effort.